Hey YouTube, how's everyone doing? It's big country time and I'm back with another video. We have a mystery box from Chalice Collectibles. Um, this is a hundred dollar box. I think there's like six pops in there. Um, it was called like the 25k grill mystery box. Um, then I have another box right here. I think this might be something Star Wars related. Um, and I got some, some cards that I picked up. So we got quite a few things to go through. Uh, we'll do the mystery box last, um, after the, we open it and we'll check out the value and then we'll just see what other kind of stuff we got. So like I said, we got, um, some, some of these cards right here. I went to a baseball game. They were giving these out for free and then, uh, got some little Pokemon cards. So, um, what should we do? Should we do the cards first? Or should we do the box? Well, let's do the cards real quick. We'll go through them real quick. I do not know anything about these cards. I don't know if it's, there's something valuable in here or not, but we will check them out and see what we got. It should be pretty fun. So how's everyone doing out there? Hope you guys are having an amazing time. Here we go. So here we go. We'll go like this. We got... We got Olaf, we got Maribel Madrigal, we have Brawl, we have Poor or Fortunate Souls, we got Pegasus, Magic Broom, Pete, Chifu, uh, look at this, we got Flounder, looks like it might, I don't know, it was upside down, that makes it, make, makes it better. We have second star to the right, Ariel's Grotto, Grotto. Over here, I think this is one of the better cards right here. It's a foil kind of looking card, Stitch. That's pretty cool. I like Stitch, got quite a few Stitch pops. And I think this is just like an extra card. But pretty cool, pretty cool. We'll go through these pretty quick. We don't want to burn too much time looking through these cards. I think the best one was the stitch. I think the last card, or second to last card, is probably the better one. Um, but you let me know if you know anything about these cards. And let me know if I got something good. Alright, so here we go. We got Tor, Aurora, Prince Elric, or Prince Eric. Fei Zhao, is that how you name, say his name? Fei Zhao. Sting into action. Argus. A pirate's life. Skettle. Ling. Goofy. Creaky. And bam, Noi. That's pretty cool. That's one of the little foil cards. Acrobatic baby. And then I guess that's, is that the same as the last one? No, it's different. All right, one more pack, one more pack. All right, stick with me, stick with me. We will get to the Funko Pops, all right? Um, I don't know what the grails are for, for this chalice box. Um, I've had this box for a few months and I tried looking for a photo for it and I couldn't find it. Uh, I just know it was, it was around a hundred dollar charge on my account. So, um, and it looks like about six pops. All right. So here we go. Last pack. Pascal. Ursula. We got Vital Sphere. Rose Lantern. Hidden Cove. Mickey Mouse. Ursula's Plan. Hercules, Flounder, oh, don't want to show the last card yet, Raja, and we're just go the regular Noi, and what's the final one? Bam! Sign the scroll. Pretty cool, pretty cool. And then here's another, I guess it's kind of like artwork. All right, well, that was them. Uh, if you know anything about these cards, let me know if there's anything good. Um, if not, we will just stick them in a pile right here and they'll just stick around for a while. Alright, and then we got some Pokemon cards. Uh, 
Another thing, I really don't know value of these Pokemon cards. But I think it's just kind of cool just to try different things. All right. So here's a little tin. There's some. Not sure what that card is. I think this might be a sticker. And. Looks like there's two packs of cards in here. Scarlet and Violet and Silver Tempest. I'm going to open the Silver Tempest first. Not that it's more valuable than I'm aware of, but I don't know. Let's just do it. Could have some really expensive card in here huh I've seen I've seen some card breaks and everything before but I really don't pay attention to value of Pokemon cards so here we go Primate Pommy Tarantula Rayulu Ultra Ball Esfafra Arvin Ooh, that's kind of looks like a cool card right here Staravia Arvin and Meow Scar Meow Scarada and energy. I don't know if people collect that. Here's the code. Alright, so I guess maybe there's three kind of foil looking cards in here. I don't even know how to tell the difference of these cards, but hey, someone out there does. All right, so one more pack, and this is the Silver Tempest. All right, all right, we're going on, go along. Hopefully it's not too long of a video. You know, hopefully we can keep your attention here. So here we go, last Pokemon cards, and then we'll get into this box right here. All right, so Bonita... Pikachu, Feral Seed, Chinchu, Patillo, ooh, Spinark, kind of has like a foil looking cover to it. And uh, Armaldo, we got Energy, Unidentified Fossil, and Araquanid, and Stone Jorner. And here's another code. All right, so I think there was only one good card in here, I think, and that was the spin arc. All right, so we've got some cards out of the way, a little bit different, not my norm. Uh, let me know what you think about that, if I should just forego any card reveals or anything for the next time. It takes too much time. You name it, let me know in the comments. All right, put that back in the pack. And here we go. This is going to be something from Mattel. It's Star Wars related. Um, and let's check it out. Oh, there you go. You kind of see the outline on our Star Wars. Oh, look at that. That is cool. Look at that. Naboo Royal Starship Star Wars Episode 1, The Phantom Menace. You guys know the iconic uh, ship right there. And you can see uh, Qui-Gon right there. But pretty cool box. kind of see the, the desert storm in there. That's pretty nice. So I'll put that right there. All right, man, awesome. So my wife picked that up for me. So thank you, Marisol, for that. All right, here we go. Here we're gonna go to the mystery box. Like I said, this was about a hundred bucks charge. I think there's three, six pops in there. Um, 25K Grail Hunt. And I do not know what the rails are. So it's a total mystery at this point. 
and it has been here for a few months. All right, so these are the bottoms of the pops right here. All right, so we're just gonna randomly start picking some out. I'll start from this far corner here and we'll check out what I got. All right, here we got one, two, three, bam. Look at that, Hunter X Hunter, Crollo, 972. That's pretty cool, pretty cool. I think that's a newer one. Let's just say, can I tell the year on this one? They keep changing the bottom of these boxes so much. So this is actually 2022. And that is a Child's Collectibles exclusive. All right. So we'll go for the next far back one here. One, two, three. Oh, bam. Phoenix Iki. That's uh, another special edition. Glow of Dark. Saint Sinya. Is that what it is? Saint Sinya? I've never seen this series. All right. Animation. I think this might be a th the theme of this box. All right. And if you guys got a close look at that one. All right, so far, neither one of these I will be keeping. So these are uh, ones I'll be selling. All right, one, two, three. Ooh, Naruto Shippuden. It's a special edition of Funko. That's a pretty cool one. I like the way he looks on that one. All right, all right. Got three more left. So far, I don't think I got any of the Grails. All right. Let's see. One, two, three. Bam! Look at that. We got Bruno Madrigo, Glow in the Dark, Special Edition Funko, Thicker. Oh, that's pretty cool. At Disney. Um, that's probably my favorite one so far, but I think there's something. Oh, Stan. Stan came off. Uh, that was pretty cool. I like that one. Um, I want to damage my Star Wars box. We'll put them right up there. All right, there's there's two more left. That's a lot of pops right here. All right, let's go. One, two, three. Ooh, fairy tale. This is a gray full buster from FY Exclusive. Yeah, pretty cool. Pretty cool. All right. No, it doesn't seem like I will be keeping any of these, but I have one more left. Will this be something I will keep? All right. Drum roll, please. One, two, three. Bam! Oh, that one's pretty cool. Funko exclusive. Captain Hook and Cart. Oh, that one's actually pretty cool. I do like the villains. And uh, what is this one? I'm trying to look for the year. Like I said, they move the dates around a lot on these things. So, and I think it's covered by covered by that pop protector. But no, it's still pretty cool. I'm thinking this might be the biggest dollar value one. So, um, I will um, I will try to put them in value. So, I haven't done the pop is right for a while. All right, so we're gonna move this settle away for right now. Um, I know it's probably the best thing here because it is Star Wars. Get your last look at it. Gonna come back here for a quick second. Set them on top of the Grand Admiral Thrawn. All right, so I probably will be making a lot of mistakes on here, but I'm not really anime orientated, so it's gonna be hard to put these in All right, so that's what I think value would be the most expensive to the least expensive. We have most expensive Captain Hook. We got Encanto, Naruto, Fairy Tale, Hunter x Hunter, and the Saint Sinya last. All right, so I'm going to take a quick break, check out value, and we'll be right back. All right, so we are back, and yeah, it's been a while since I did the pop is right, and uh, yeah, I, I got them all all pretty much wrong except for this one. This is the least expensive. I, I, everything else is uh, a little mixed up. So 
we will start off from over here. Um, so this one is the lowest at $10. All right, so um, I guess not really many like this one, but uh, still cool. Um, Hunter X Hunter. This one is coming in at 23. Not bad, not bad. And then the fairy tale, which um, it showed the special edition sticker at 35, but it didn't show the price for FYE. I would think this FYE would be the same. So it's either 35 or unknown. So um, probably 35. Um, the next one is going to be the Naruto. This one did have a chase. Um, this is not the chase, I don't think, but um, this one is only coming in at $15. I think the chase was uh, upper upwards of $40 to $48, but um, I like the way he looks on there. That's pretty cool. So um, $15. Um, Encanto, Bruno Madrigal, uh, only $15. So um, not sure. I would have thought this one would have been worth more. It's pretty cool. I like the the green eyes and I'd like to see what the glow looks like but 15 and then also a surprise on this one the Captain Hook and Cart Funko exclusive uh, must be still available I'm not sure but it's only coming in at $15 as well so like I said I think it came out to around a hundred dollars so you know right there at 15 if they were all $15 you know that's uh, you know, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 90, that's $90. So I think I got value because some of them were over 15, um, you know, include shipping and handling and everything, but no, not bad. But um, if you're interested in any of these, um, I'm probably not keeping any of them. Even though I like villains, I probably will let that one go. Don't really have much more room on my, my pops over there for Disney. Um, but yeah, hit me up on Instagram. Uh, if you don't know my Instagram, it's uh, big underscore country underscore Stephen S T E V I N. Um, throw out a throw out a price, and we'll see what we can work out. Otherwise, they probably will end up on eBay. Um, and I am behind in putting stuff on eBay, so I have a lot of stuff here that has not been listed yet. So best way to uh, give me an offer is on my Instagram. All right. That's big country time, out.